in the College of Engineering at North Carolina Agricultural and Technical State University, I find that, as you said, there are so many things that I am, am proud of here. I am proud of the research that our students and our faculty are engaged in together. And it ranges from materials to cybersecurity to environmental sustainability issues. It's a whole range of research that we're, we're wonderful in and that we're leaders in. But I think if I had to narrow down what I'm most proud of here, I am most proud of our students. They are just the energy of who we are as a college, but they are also the ideas and they have taken to heart the fact that they are indeed the future for all of us. And so when you see one of our talented students and when you see how excited they are, when they are focused on delivering in their work and, and they're excited about the field and their future, they are unstoppable. We find that those students who understand that their leadership matters in, in the, in the uh, organizations that they've already been a part of, or they understand that there are, are really problems in the world that they want to tackle, but they know they need a certain foundation first. I feel like engineering can do a lot more than just sit behind the desk and do math equations and uh, technical things. Um, I've grown into a leader and I want to take my leadership skills and develop them in, um, in different ways to give back to the African-American community at large. But we're also interested in those students who have an inkling that this is an area that they're interested in and just haven't had a chance to explore it yet. Um, hopefully, they came in with the right math and science because when you don't, it means that it takes a little bit longer for you to graduate. And that's why the early education question that you asked was so important. If you come in with that already, you have the choices before you. So those students who are excited about uh, learning, but also about applying what they learn in order to s create engineering solutions and computer science solutions are the wonderful students for us. And the exposure definitely helps like at a younger age when it comes to you know, your brain processing, because computer science isn't like a normal type of thing to think about. So I think when I was younger, it was great to get my mind to start training towards that direction, to think more logically. In middle school, I was able to have a robotics project in my science class, and that kind of piqued my interest more into engineering as well. And I always knew from that point that I was going to do engineering, and I chose mechanical because I wanted to have more of a hands-on major, so that's how I ended up with mechanical engineering. I think the biggest thing that ANT has done to help me excel is made me feel number one at home and made me feel that there aren't any limitations uh, that are stopping me from excelling. Throughout my collegiate experience, faculty and staff have always been supportive, always encouraging me to uh, push beyond what I thought I could see, to see myself. And I remember as a sophomore, as I was speaking to one of my professors about going to get a PA, uh, uh, MBA, he, he kind of looked at me and said, well, you, may want, you might want to get an MBA, but I think you'll be doing yourself a disservice just by getting an MBA. I can see you as a PhD candidate. And at that time, I never really considered that. But just to know that somebody else believed and saw me as a, a prominent scholar made me want to push to, to accomplish great things. Community college uh, is extremely important to us. We have spent the last part of 2012 as a college really evaluating ways to make sure the transition from community college to our, our, our four-year college is, is effective and smooth. Some students may decide to go to community college first, but what we have found is the students who decide to do that and then come to us, as long as we can help with that transition of now just being in a different environment, they excel, they do well. But it's important that we help them with the transition in the sense of as many of the courses as they need, we want them to take while they're getting their associate's degree in the community college, so that by the time they come here, we want it to be a quick, as in as minimal as possible, uh, to graduation with their bachelor's degree. And so, um, so what they can expect is it's a vibrant env environment, but we value our community college transfer students and we welcome them to here to North Carolina Agriculture and Technical State University's College of Engineering. We are proud of who we are as a college and we welcome uh, newcomers so that you can start to understand who we are and figure out ways to partner. Our partnerships uh, with corporations, our partnership with government agencies, our partnership even with other universities is one of the ways that we have an enriching environment to the benefit of the education of our students. 